This is Eddie Vedder's Tulum. Uh, it's a similar style and uh, technique to the lesson I did for Guaranteed, but a bunch of you were asking to learn how to play this one, so I'll show it to you really quickly. It's a short, sweet piece. It's built in the key of C major, and again, it's Travis picked, and there's a couple little things that are a little squirrely about getting it. If you really slow the, uh, the recording down, you can hear it, but um, let's just start with, what's gonna, with the basic right hand pattern and the chords. So we start on the C major triad in the open position, and we're going to Travis pick between strings 5 and 2. So what we're going to do is begin by pinching strings 5 and 2 together, then we do the inside apart, 4 to 3, and then 5 to 2, and 4 to 3. You know, another, another way to talk about this would be sit, take, together, and then apart. Sometimes it's easier to think about that in two, in two little chunks. So the, the Travis picking pattern will be making sure your thumb is doing the two alternating bass notes from five to four. That's really important. So now let's throw some melody in there. So the melody is going to come from once to the pattern. Then we add our pinky to D on the second string at the third fret. going to do next is we're going to bring our pointer finger over on the first string to the F. So we leave our pinky down and this is important. We're now creating a C, add 9 is the D, the 11 is the F. So this is C, add 9, add 11. So we come to the first two chords. I'm bringing my pointer finger over and now my Travis picking pattern changes to this new chord. I'll pinch strings five and one together. My th thumb goes to the third string. This is really important because now we're skipping the fourth string. So our thumb plays from five to three. The pattern is still the same though. We're pinching strings five and one, three and two apart, five and one, three and two. just play that a bunch and get that under your fingers. So here we are so far. Right? And the next note we're going to play is we just lift our pointer finger. That's where it's going to get a little crazy too. Keeping our pinky down. Okay, now on the right hand, uh, so I'm sorry, the melody is open E on the first string. The right hand for this pattern is going to play five and two together. Three, two, five, one, and then it ends on, you pluck three and two together. Okay, now the way the song will reset as you speed it up quickly is it's kind of a little pull off from resetting to go back to C major. Let me show you that again. we can begin. Right? Okay, so that, that's the basic melody pattern for the tune. Next we go to D7 with an F sharp in the bass. This part's pretty easy. Um, play, play a D7, middle finger on the F sharp on the sixth string. We'll be playing strings six, four, three, and two. Same pattern. Bring that melody up to D. And then the way I play it, just out of, for me, it's easier is to bring my thumb up over the top. Because we're basically playing the same chord with an F in the bass. So we're basically creating an F major chord. With that D there. Another way you could finger this is pointer finger over the bass note. We go back to C. So so that's it. Uh, then you know in the next section there's some little change variations with the melody, but this is the basic gist of how the song goes. So to review you gotta get this Travis picking pattern down. The together, inside voices apart, outside voices apart, inside voices apart. That's really important. Um, and then building that melody over top. That little pull off.
off at the end. So I think that'll help you. Um, let me know if it doesn't make sense. I'll try to clear it up for you. Thanks.